The BlueWorks Live Glossary contains the property values used in processes and other items in your account. The glossary provides an effective way to manage all of the values that are used across your account to help encourage best practices and standardize on terminology. The BlueWorks Live Glossary values are used when you document process details. To open an activity in a process, right-click on the activity and select Details. When you place your cursor over a property value, you can see the description for that value from the glossary. When you populate process details, values from the glossary appear in the selection list. Preferred values appear first and are marked with a blue ribbon. Preferred values are designated as standard terms in your account. When possible, you should select the appropriate preferred value. If none of the preferred values are appropriate, you can select a non-preferred value or enter your own value. If you enter a new value rather than selecting an existing value from the list, the new value is added to the glossary. This helps build the glossary by allowing you to add values that haven't yet been defined. You should also enter a description for the value you added so other users will understand the meaning of the value you added. Let's look at how values appear in the BlueWorks Live Glossary. To access the glossary, go to the Library section of BlueWorks Live and click on the Glossary tab. In the glossary, you can expand a section to see all of the values for a specific property. Each glossary value has a description or definition. If one doesn't exist, you can add one. To add a description, select the value you want, click on the Description field, and type in the description. This description will be available to BlueWorks Live users who have access to that value when they populate properties and process blueprint details. The values marked with a ribbon are preferred values. For a given property, preferred values are those that represent standard terms within your account. To see where a value is used in an account, click on the green arrow that appears when you move your cursor over the value. In this example, you can see that the value Accounting is used in two processes. The Where Used feature also gives you alternative views by space and by activity. By clicking on one of the listed processes, you can see the specific activities in the process that use the value. You can also navigate to the activity by selecting the hyperlink over the activity name. We hope this short video helped you understand how BlueWorks Live Glossary can help you achieve deeper understanding and greater consistency in your process blueprints. If you have any questions, contact us at support at blueworkslive.com.